Happy Friday, and welcome back to Men's Men's Roundtable, Conversations with Women of Power and Grace, where we empower and inspire women to embrace their inner guidance and live authentically. In today's episode, we will explore how social conditioning has shaped and influenced your life, leading to negative impacts on your well-being, from societal expectations to ingrained stereotypes, we will uncover the deep-rooted effects of this conditioning and provide practical steps to break free from these constraints. In this episode, you will learn the profound influence of social conditioning on your life and how it shapes your beliefs, behaviors, and opportunities. You will learn the negative impact of prioritizing societal expectations on your mental health, self-esteem, and overall well-being. And you will learn practical steps for you to overcome this conditioning by including self-awareness and self-care practices. Society has long dictated norms and expectations for you from a young age, shaping your beliefs, behaviors, and aspirations. This social conditioning often manifests in you feeling pressure to conform to certain standards of beauty, behavior, and success, sometimes leading to feelings of inadequacy, self-doubt, and low self-esteem. Moreover, these influences can limit your opportunities for growth and fulfillment in various aspects of your life including career advancement, personal relationships, and overall happiness. As a specialist in women's spirituality, I can shed light on the detrimental effects of social conditioning, mental health and well-being, and would emphasize the importance of recognizing these influences and taking proactive steps to challenge and overcome them. Now here are five practical strategies to reclaim your autonomy and redefine your self-worth beyond societal expectations. Seek out first resources, communities, and knowledge that uplift and empower you. Surrounding yourself with positive influences, if necessary, seek professional guidance that help you to navigate and overcome the negative impacts of social conditioning. Remember that social conditioning is not out there. You can find it in your backyard, family structure, friendships, and other relationships. When you cultivate the following practices in your routine, you will connect with your inner wisdom and trust your intuition even more. One, cultivate self-compassion. Embrace your inner guidance, starting with being kind and understanding towards you, yourself. Practice self-compassion by treating yourself with same warmth and care you would offer to a close friend. Acknowledge your strengths, forgive your shortcomings, and be gentle with yourself through life's ups and downs. Two, trust your intuition. You possess a powerful inner guidance system in the form of intuition. Trust your gut feelings and instincts as they often serve as valuable indicators of what aligns with your true desires and needs. Listen to that inner voice, honor your intuition, and allow it to guide you towards decisions that resonate with your authentic self. Three, prioritize self-awareness. Reflect on societal norms and beliefs that have shaped the perception of your capabilities and practice. Dedicate time to explore your values, passions, and goals, and gain a deeper understanding of who you are and what truly matters to you. Self-awareness is a journey of empowerment that allows you to align 
with your inner guidance. Four, set boundaries. Establishing clear boundaries is essential for honoring your inner guidance and protecting your well-being. Learn to say no to people, situations, or commitments that do not align with your values or tend to drain your energy. By setting healthy boundaries, you create space for self-expression, self-care, and alignment with your inner wisdom. Last but not least, practice mindfulness. Mindfulness is a powerful tool for tuning into your inner guidance and living in the present moment. Engage in mindfulness practices such as meditation, deep breathing, or yoga to quiet the external noise and connect with your inner essence. By being fully present and attuned to your inner voice, you can make decisions that are authentic and aligned with your true self. By embracing these life-changing steps, you can cultivate a deeper connection to your inner guidance, trust your intuition, and navigate life with clarity, purpose, and authenticity. Remember that your inner wisdom is a guiding light that can lead you towards a fulfilling and empowered life. We can do a short meditation here. Close your eyes and take a deep breath, allowing yourself to settle into a state of calm and inner peace. In this moment, I invite you to envision breaking free from the chains that bind you, limiting your potential and holding you back from prioritizing yourself. Picture these chains disintegrating, falling away like dust. As you step into a newfound sense of liberation and empowerment. Feel the weight lifting off your shoulders. Releasing the burdens of societal or family expectations and self-doubt. From this moment, you are free to honor yourself, your needs, and your aspirations without hesitation or apology. Now, imagine a glowing light within you, radiating with strength, confidence, and self-love. Embrace this light as a beacon of guidance illuminating the path towards prioritizing your well-being and authenticity. Trust in your inner wisdom, your intuition, and your innate worth as you navigate your journey with clarity and purpose. And in this space of reflection and peace, affirm to yourself, 
I am worthy of prioritizing myself. I release all that no longer serves me and I embrace my true essence with open arms. I trust in my inner guidance to lead me towards a life of fulfillment, empowerment, and self-love. Now take a moment to bask in this newfound sense of freedom and self-awareness, carrying this empowering energy with you as you step back into the world. Remember, breaking the chains begins with honoring yourself. And choosing to prioritize your well being with compassion and strength. You are deserving, you are capable, and you are enough. Now you may gently open your eyes. As we conclude today's episode, we hope that our discussion has shed light on the complex dynamics of social conditioning and its impact on your life by empowering you to challenge these influences and prioritizing your well-being you can strive towards a more inclusive and equitable society for all as you fill your cup as your cup becomes full the overflow ripple into your immediate family, friends, relationships, and community. Thank you for tuning in to Men's Men's Roundtable, Conversations with Women of Power and Grace. And if you found this episode insightful, don't forget to subscribe and share it with others who may benefit from these important conversations. Join us next time as we continue to explore topics that inspire change and promote empowerment. Remember, breaking free from societal conditioning starts with acknowledging your worth and embracing your true self. After all, you are a woman of power and grace. Let no one tell you otherwise. Until next time, stay empowered and inspired. Many blessings.